Yo guys, so I'm going to be showing you how to get custom tire textures in Pipe. Uh, before I actually start, don't forget to back up your files so you don't have to reinstall the game. Uh, so first of all you're going to need to get some sort of uh, texture. Make sure it's a 512 by 512 pixels image because they work best. I think that's the default size anyway. So The first thing you're going to want to do is get Unity Assets Bundle Extractor uh, If you don't have it already, just uh, look it up on Google, I'm sure you'll find it But open that up Go to File Open Go to your Pipe Directory And then open Resource.Assets so you get this window here and you're going to want to click view, search by name, and then type in galaxy. Press enter or OK and you'll get galaxy here. You'll see it's a material. You're going to want to go ahead and click export raw. I'm just going to export it to my desktop. Uh, you don't have to change the name if you don't want to, I'm not going to. You can do, but there's not much point. So there you go, I have it here. So now this time we're going to want to search for tire underscore zero. So tire underscore zero, press enter, and you'll get it here. So an import rule. And then you're going to select the file that you literally just exported. So open it. So now you'll have a galaxy texture for your tire, but I'm going to be showing you how to get your custom ones, so like ones that you've made or downloaded elsewhere. First go to view, search by name, and search galaxy again. So it will bring you to the material again, but this time you want to press F3, and then it'll take you to the texture file, so you'll get it here. Go ahead and click plugins, edit, load, and then select your custom image slash texture, whatever you want to call it. Go ahead and open that up, press OK, you'll get this window, press OK again. And now there you go. So now you're going to want to click file, save, and then save it to your desktop. Uh, don't change the name, keep it as resources, and then you'll get it here. So now you're going to want to close uh, Unity Asset Bundle Extractor. You're going to want to go to your pipe directory, pipe data, and then take this resource file and drag it in there. Press replace. And then there you go, 